everybody, Keith Nelson with the Toronto Chop and Schmidt Music here, and another instrument demo. Today, we're going to be looking at one of the Yamaha bass trombone offerings, specifically the YBL421. So this is their intermediate level bass trombone uh, featuring a single um, F rotor, so B flat F instrument. We know that in the bass trombone community, the dual rotor setup has become the gold standard. And there's a lot of very, very good reasons why that worked for them, not the least of which actually giving us full access to low C, low B, low staff, giving us a lot of different you know, position options with it. But there are certain times when maybe we don't need to have you know, two valves. Um, sometimes for younger players, it ends up being heavier, more complex. Uh, for somebody, maybe they have um, arm issues, hand issues, they can't handle an every, uh, heavier instrument. Sometimes a single rotor setup can be a really, really good fit for them. Of course, everybody knows about George Roberts, and he made his career playing on a single rotor bass trombone here. So the Yamaha 421, I think, is a really, really nice example of what these instruments can do. So this has a uh, two-piece gold brass bell, laser welded, uh, full yellow brass outer slide with a uh, yellow brass crook on it. Uh, it is a 563 bore, so just slightly bigger, nine and a half inch bell. And it does have a what they call a semi-closed wrap. So you know, they're trying to keep it, you know, opened up a little bit more, but still a closed wrap here. Um, but again, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Again, for sometimes for younger players, um, having a little more resistance in the lower register with that closed wrap can actually be more beneficial for them. So, I thought I'd take a quick play here on the 421 so you can hear this in action. <laughs> consistency. Um, I personally actually really like the impact you can get from this instrument. You know, the sound may be a little bit too focused for a lot of players in, for example, an orchestral situation, but boy, especially as like a, you know, a jazz bass trombone, um, it's something that's going to at least give you a lot of punch in uh, that lower register and something, again, I really like the responsiveness of as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, as always, if you have any experience with the 421 or other single rotor based trombones, if you have a favorite instrument, let us know about that in the comments. Um, think about giving us a thumbs up on the video. If you haven't done so already, think about subscribing to our channel here and you can find us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter as well. So thank you very much for watching.